What's sipping, homies? We're on a whole other adventure today, traveling around California. We stopped in Morro Bay. We ate some delicious foods. I forgot to record the front of the place, but nonetheless, you're gonna see the food we ate. And we couldn't find parking at the beach, so we ended up at another location. Where? Stay tuned to find out. It's definitely one of the coolest views that we have over here. Kind of thing of the rock. It's pretty fresh. Dad! Geo's food come up. And brew high. And the parentals with the clam chowder. Bomb. No, this is clam chowder. We got some barbecue clams, garlic butter, halibut and chips, and calamari and chips. Oh yeah. <laughs> have, these are oysters. Most people like will kill for these. I know. Have you you've never had a oyster at all? I've had one grilled oyster, maybe two. But oh okay. I've never had raw, but even then, like the grilled ones were still kind of like yeah. You know, like it kind of felt a little weird about kind, it. But kind of raw. Like, like, for you guys. Did you put some lemon on it? It's a legit. I'm like I'm like Geo, man. I legit just use my finger, man. Amy, Amy uses a fork and he gets all. You should see the raw ones, man. She decorates it like it's freaking. Uh, dude, look at how. Dude, that looks. It tastes good. I just taste it like the top of it. Wow. Wow. That's bomb. Dude, these are crazy. Yeah. Really good. Well, thank God for the mess up. You have to put the whole thing down, bro. You're like, you're like eating. These are so good. That's a bomb. Yeah, yeah, definitely recommend. Yeah. I'm gonna get these next time. Yeah, dude. We saw oysters and couldn't resist. Oh my gosh, thank you guys. <laughs> no doubt, no doubt. Same oysters y'all's got. Let me get my crack at this boy. Oh, wow. It's so good. This is the first time you've ever had it cooked. That's a different experience from just a raw oyster. <laughs> this is bomb. Yeah, I'm gonna order another bubble. Yeah, I don't know where he goes, but that's can't take. You can take the man out the hood, but you can't take the hood out the man. I'm curious to see what's in the bag now, <laughs> sir. Yeah, I want to see what's in the bag, sir. <laughs> I'm and serious. He's big smile on his yeah, head. he's he's cheesing, man. That's a burger. No, I wish. What are you get a sandwich? Oh my god! I don't think. Dude, why is it greasy though? Yeah, that's the same, man. He's like, I don't know, man. Some dude was selling it. Rock. Oh, unless, unless you're a rock. What the hell? <laughs> it's always the best traveling with Amy. She makes road sandwiches now. I don't even know if I'm hungry, but just the fact that I know there's sandwiches. Might as well. Might as well. Yellow. She's got like a whole buffet back there, man. So. <laughs> she does have mac and cheese, look. <laughs> we ain't going hungry on this damn road, that's for sure. And y'all probably really can't see, but that in and out spread is what Amy made the sandwiches with. <laughs> so, 
If you got those, man, throw some cheese, throw some ham, and you are good to go. In and out spread sandwich. Bomb.com. Where we at, girl? We are in Solvang, California, and oh. let me tell you, they have the best treats. Period. Their bakery, their sausage, their bread, their beer, Period. ice cream, everything. Period. Bomb day. Plenty of public parking. So if one lot isn't filled, keep looking around. Good thing about Sylvain is that parking is free. Yay! It's the less thing to worry about paying. sausage garden it's outside there's no indoor seating so if you come on a day where it's hot like this you're gonna enjoy a nice cool beer but even even then when it's a cold day bring your parka and bring your thirst because though even though it's cold the beer is still bomb over here and they have a whole different range of it so make sure you stop over here stop at the sausage garden get you a cold beer Yeah. So you can't go wrong with the sausage sampler and they have a bunch of sausages to choose from. So make sure you get down on them, pick a beer, and pick a sausage of your choice. So just keep in mind when you come to Solvang, everything closes early. So if you're gonna always spend a day here, get an early start. Because as you can see, things are already closed. I'd say 6 o'clock is around that. Eh, I would say that's around the time that everything starts to close. Gift shops and all. So most of it means like little mom and pop shops over here too. And especially if you come over to one of their staple over here, the Danish Bill Bakery. A lot of stuff tend to sell out. But they have buckets. Buckets of cookies, which is the bomb.com. So, ooh, but they look like they are fully stocked in here right now. So. Give them a sub. Let's get that counter up. There are 54, 66 for IG. And what's not to want to give them a little follow? How good everything looks. Look. Oh man, this is heaven right here. Yee! Let's go make a brother want to sing. Look, look. So this is a jam. Gotta go here, man. Old Danish food farm, Fudge Kitchen, and the fudge is fire. Yeah. What? Spicy jalapeno cotton candy. So, yeah. This is definitely, definitely the place. If you love treats, Solvain's got it. This place has got fudge. Woo! So, whether you know or not, in the motherland, we call that peanut butter. We are Belizean, but not Belizeans. What do they call it? Goat shit. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> That's so me at work. <laughs> Under my desk. That's what I'm talking about. Bump it, bump it, bump it. And that's a wrap. Time to go home. So, they didn't exactly plan out the way we did, but it was dope. Congratulations again to Gila and Grace. Expected baby number three. It was great having lunch with them. 
what? Brunch. Seafood, but it was dope. So went up to Morro Bay, absolutely loved it. Can't wait to go back. Stopped in Solvane, and now we're heading home. So it was a great day, definitely a great day. Two different temperatures. One went from perfect to hot as hell. So thank you for joining us. See you soon.